my delicious co-creators part two of this video with jose actually it's literally part three yesterday we've done another video beautiful video on the what was it about oh my god we spoke about the, the, the sexuality orgasm of orgasms. course <laughs> we are That's talking it. about orgasms from one week ago yes. <laughs> <laughs> this is a big topic here at the tao garden uh for many reasons and you can also check the video i've done an interview with Mantashia. Now, this video is on masculine ejaculation, okay. holding it. Tell us about your, your background and how you get to learn about this, because I know this is a big part. This was your learning curve. Huh? Well, yeah, you know, well, 14, 15 years ago, I was doing porno movies. I have a friend who was a big actor, and I was doing the camera like you and, and helping him with some, some parts of his business until the day that we missed the actor <laughs> in the scene, and I decided to try. I can do it. Yeah. <laughs> I want to do it. I want to see if I'm ready. I want to see what these people is feeling when they have to do this, you know, in front of the other people, how my body is going to react. And the first thing that you understand when you have to do this is that you cannot come, you cannot ejaculate when you want. Mm. You feel like, oh my God, we was having sex for one hour, must be okay. Can I ejaculate right now? No, 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 no. Now we have to do pictures and we have to do this and this and blah, blah, blah. And we have to repeat this, this position. Oh my God, how can I manage this? Well, I was training by myself, just stimulating my body every day, in the morning, three times a day. And I was trying to understand how can I control my ejaculation? The first thing that I, I was learning was the impact of my breathing, of my pattern of breathing. If, okay, if you are doing, this is like my daily practice consists in a, stimulation you can use coconut oil try to do something different you know coconut oil it's amazing for men and women you can you can put it inside it's a uh, if it's uh, natural it's perfect for the body really nice and have a nice taste also <laughs> use some coconut oil stimulate yourself not just your penis just stimulate your testicles just uh, move your sexual energy stimulate your breast and okay hold your pennies and try you are uh, stimulating your body now if you are going close to the point of non-return that means that if you pass this point you are going to ejaculate you are going to have an orgasm you can stop after that point okay the first thing that we have to do is to make a kind of big brother watching us you know it's like i'm going to watch my body I'm going to be here, but one part of me is going to watch my body, what I'm doing. If I'm stimulating my body and I'm close to that point, my breathing is going to change. This is the first thing. If I'm breathing in a natural way, like <sighs> my breathing is going to fire. That means that I'm going to do something like <sighs> Okay, uh, I, can, I can follow the same rhythm, but I don't have to stop. But what mean, what happened if I do <sighs> and I change to <sighs> I can follow here faster, but I can change my pattern of rhythm to water. Mm. I don't have to change both things. I can follow this faster rhythm, but I can change just my, my breathing. And I will do something like <sighs> Let's see what happened if I do this. This is just one exercise. It's amazing. Mm. You will feel something. Let's see. You can send her <laughs> your questions <laughs> after <laughs> <watching> <laughs> the video. <laughs> okay, this is one thing. This is you, the expert. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get some really good comments on the, this video, <laughs> I feel. <laughs> okay, we are waiting for your comments. <laughs> okay, second thing that your body is going to do is when you are close to the orgasm, what happened with your testicles? Do you know? Do you remember? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I know that you are not a man, <laughs> but if you, you say if you was having sex with a man, just ne okay, next time pay attention. What's up? Yes. Yes. yes, right. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's the question, <laughs> yeah, you pass it. <laughs> yeah, testicles go up yes. just a few seconds before. If you feel that your testicles want to go in, just grab your testicles and pull out. It's so simple. And breathe. 
and feel what I feel here, what is happening. I feel calm now. Let's see. Another thing, my legs. When we are close to the orgasm, our legs want to go straight. If you feel that your legs do this, okay, do the opposite. Try to find a position. You can put your feet together and be sitting like in flow, and not, not lotus flower, but with your feet together and open your legs and feel. Can I control it better like this? You know, this is the, the, the first objective that we have to do. It's like we are going to uh, stimulate ourselves watching our reactions. Mm -hmm. And with this, we are going to have a map of our own reactions because for every man it's going to be different. When you will have this map, you will understand in a natural way that, okay, I'm close to the non-return point. What I have to do now? Stop and enjoy this feeling. That's the key. Mm. It's difficult to understand for a man, but what I understand after seven years practicing sexual kung fu is that... You call it sexual kung fu, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kung fu means daily practice. I love this word, you know. And at the end, what I understand is that when we are uh, close to this orgasm, uh, if we change all these patterns and we forget the, the, the this uh, obsession to achieve the Perform. orgasm, yes, we are going to experience so many things that we was just lost in on the way. But at the same time that you have to practice all this physical part of, of the training, it's really important to practice meditation. This is why the first thing that I teach to a man is the basic uh, practices from our school, in a smile, healing sounds, how to open your microcosmic orbit. Because the question is, if you are going to, ret uh, how do you say in English, retener, to, to don't ejaculate, to hold, to hold your, f your, your semen, you have to uh, move this energy from your genitals. Mm. If you don't do this, you are going to feel maybe testicle pain. Every man have this, uh, had this experience or have an experience like that. I remember when I was 16 and I was going to the cinema for the first time with my girlfriend and I was just trying to touch her body and I was having an erection for two hours. And after this, what happened, guys? Pain, mm. testicle pain. Well, if you feel this, it's because you are not doing the practice in the right way. Take care with this. That means that all the energy is, is, is here in this area and is stuck there. If you are doing this, you are going to have problems. The question is, you have to combine this practical part of the training with the meditation. It's really important. The, mic to o the opening of the microcosmic orbit is really important. Yeah. And in this, uh, Master Chia is the best one. It's a lot about uh, then uh, uh, just uh, g giving the sexual energy to the different organs. So how does that work for a man? At which point, when do well you do it? I know it's a long thing, but yeah. just in few words. Well, the first thing is to open. It's powerful energy. We want to use it. Well, yes, it's you so powerful. Waste it. yeah. Yes, imagine that, uh, that that you can use all this energy in a creative way. If you can stimulate, if you can bring this energy to your brain, you are going to stimulate your brain. You are going to be super creative that day. <laughs> you don't want to sleep after this. You want to maybe you want to paint. You want to write something. You feel inspired, or maybe you can use this energy to have lucid dreams at night. You can use this energy. This is the beginning of the alchemy, the alchemy. Mm. You know, is is how to use this sexual energy for different things for enlightenment, for working, for creative things, for art, up to you. But what was the question? The process, <laughs> like how do you, at which point, when does it happen? Okay, the first thing is, I call, I say that the first thing that we have to train is uh, building this sensitivity mm. and sensibility also in our body. And the first thing that we have to learn is how to perceive our own energy. If you can feel your energy, you are really open now to this process of feeling the energy moving inside you. The second part 
is to release our emotions because sexual energy is like uh, an antenna, can amplify everything. If you are holding bad emotions, you are going to amplify these emotions. What you want is you want to be in a calm state, in a positive state before doing your practice. And you are going to amplify just positive things. This is what we want. The third part is opening the microcosmic cor orbit and making circulate this energy through our body. Maybe then opening the upper channel and down there, the, 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 the earth. Yeah, connecting our perineum to the earth, our crown to the sky, and with the eyes and uh, a pattern of breathing, we will do like, I'm looking with my eyes inside me, guiding the energy through my spine to my brain, and down, my tongue touching the palate, up, and down, and we can do our practice, we can stimulate ourselves, and if you feel that you are close to this orgasm, stop, and bring this energy to the crown. And if you feel that your energy is moving in this orbit, now the energy is ready to go everywhere, because from this orbit is connected to everywhere. And you can span, if you focus your mind when you are having the orgasm in your heart and in the feeling of love, the energy is going to be there and you are going to feel this expansion inside your heart. Heart orgasm. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. You like yeah. that? I love it. How does that feel like for a man? Oh my God. You cry. You cry of happiness. You, you see, I'm, I'm just thinking and my skin is reacting because, yeah, you feel like a child. You feel like, oh my God, I was losing the time <laughs> all my life. You know, me or <laughs> like, like men, we used to be disconnected from our emotions. For you, it's more easy to be connected to your emotions, but maybe you are more disconnected to your physical body. Mm -hmm. This is this duality. We are more connected with our bodies, but totally disconnected uh, to our emotions. And this process of uh, the basic training, doing inner smile every day, doing these simple meditations that everyone can understand and do so easy, you are going to develop this, this sensitivity. This is uh, the beginning. If you don't practice meditation, it's going to be so difficult for you to feel these experiences, to have these experiences. Yeah. Mm. Is there some books you recommend just on the top of your head? Sure. All Master Chia books, uh, the multi-orgasmic man, multi-orgasmic couple, uh, multi-orgasmic woman. Uh, Master Chia have a lot of books who talks about uh, sexual energy, but... Um, you have a different spin on it. Yeah, but the question at the end is you have to go to a workshop or you have to be initiated in a personal way yeah. because that was my feeling. When I was reading Master Chia book, I was like, I cannot understand this. Yeah. You know, someone have to explain me face to face, have to teach me, have to touch me, yeah. teaching me this at the yeah. same time. It's very healthy too for men to meet in this way also. Yes, yes. We need the practical experience first and after the book is going to help us to remember and to to go to the details yeah, yeah. thank you jose thank, thank you so much it was a pleasure to meet you and uh, what a beautiful another beautiful video uh if you have not seen the video with uh, for the woman you can see it because woman yeah. ejaculation there is another <laughs> one we just did beautiful thank you so thank much you. a pleasure thank you lilu thank you to everyone awesome big bye. kiss from thailand bye <laughs> Then have your comments here. Yeah, comments, comments, <laughs> <laughs> likes. <laughs> Bye.